Okay, what do I have in my hands? Now what you want to do is pop a little bit of whipped chips inside, so don't put the whole thing in. Hi, um, so I'm Camilla Zanzanaini. I'm the founder of Nature Makers Lab. Um, so the idea of Nature Makers Lab is really to bring more biodiversity into the city. Uh, and we're doing that by planting more native species uh, in Hong Kong and, and anywhere around um, the urban areas that we can. Good morning! Yeah, so well, the idea is that we create nature in the city. These are trees that can be up to 15 to 20 meters tall. Do you know how tall that is? Taller than that. Definitely taller than that. So today we're at uh, ICHK Hong Lot Yun, International College Hong Kong, and we're planting the first Miyawaki forest in Hong Kong with the, with the kids, with the students. Uh, it's primary school, so they're from ages around 8 to 12 who are going to be planting with us. Miyawaki is, uh, is a very special method. It was uh, invented by a botanist, a Japanese botanist, who basically studied forests for 30 years and found that um, actually if you plant native species very densely together, very closely together, they actually will create a system um, and they will start supporting each other. So you're actually planting a forest. So we are planting three to four trees per square meter, which is quite unusual. We chose uh, more than 50 species of local species in Hong Kong, um, and they come from different layers of a forest. All right, can I get 12 in a row? Keep it like that, okay? And the kids today, what they're doing is they're each grabbing you know, a shovel, a tree, and some wood chips and stuff, and they're digging holes and then popping it in. We're doing it species by species. One grown tree can be as effective as 10 air conditioners. In theory, a forest should be able to cool down the area around it by up to five degrees, even six if it's a really high functioning one. But in this kind of weather, we're hoping that by next Christmas, um, hopefully we'll have nice coverage already of uh, more than one meter tall of, of all the plants, or even maybe some will even be two meters. So really anywhere in Hong Kong um, is, is, is a great spot. Um, so the, the, the nice thing about Miyawaki is it doesn't have to be a very big space, which in Hong Kong obviously is a very dense city. It's not that easy to, to, find, to find room. The one limitation for the method is that it needs to be on the ground because you do need to create a forest. Um, and so that is a limitation. It can't really be on a rooftop, for example. Uh, otherwise, you would never be able to leave it on its own. So the idea is that we take care of it for a couple years and then it's a self-sustaining system. My motivation, it's really like from a biodiversity lens. And, um, and really like I'd love there to be more of a mindset change to have this kind of idea that, you know, by planting native species and by planting a lot of diversity, we're actually bringing in uh, a function that is helping the planet but also helping us.